This is all over. A large number of seabird species have had plastics recorded in them. And some seabird species, almost every individual has, that has been found has had plastic inside them. People need to realize that when they throw something into the street or into the, you know, just into the open fields, it ends up in the ocean. I'm Colleen Maloney, I come from Cape Town. I'm a marine ecologist and I have been studying plastic in the oceans for the last 33 years. So the plastic bags are often eaten um, and they would then choke animals if they get stuck in their digestive tracts. This is the sort of thing that we worry about, that size or they also, um, a lot of, for example, seabirds are not able to excrete them. So they accumulate in their stomachs. And so then it, you know, the stomach feels full and the animal thinks it's eaten, but it hasn't. So they starve to death. Plastic in itself is not bad. It's the fact that we don't use it and reuse it enough times because it is too cheap. This kind of thing is where we should be um, aiming the solutions. We don't need one use plastics. We need some of the other stuff. It's very important, very useful, but we don't need this stuff. It's, it's, it's everywhere um, and it's infiltrated into the natural environment in a way that we probably will never be able to get rid of it.